here is how to download mods for the U11 Nomad. Now first, you're going to want to go to nexusmods.com slash blade and sorcery nomad. Then you can just pick any mod. I'm going to go for John Wick. So, click on it, then you go to files. Now you're going to need to make an account. So I'm just going to log in. Then you go to manual download. And you just click slow download. Now that that's downloading, you just open it up. You right click and press extract all, or it might be a little bit different on uh, Windows 10 if you're on Windows 10. Then you just copy it. Then you're going to need to connect your Quest 2 to your laptop or PC. Then you're going to want to go into your VR headset and just tap allow access. Once you've copied it, then you can go to Quest 2 internal shared storage. Android, data, warpfrog.blade and sorcery, files, mods, and just paste it in. Now you have this mod. Now I'm gonna to go to some reasons why your mod might not might not be working. Alright, one reason that happens a lot is you've extracted it all, but you've copied and pasted the version with all the numbers at the end. If if you've got the version with all the numbers at the end you just want to open that up and get the file from inside another reason for why your mod might not be working is that you've downloaded a u10 mod but you're on u11 or you've downloaded a u11 mod but you're on u10 there is no fix to this you just got to download u10 mods if you're on u10 u11 mods if you're on u11 easy way to tell if you're on U10 or U11 is if you you can open the doors up and go outside that means you're on U11 if you can't you're on U10 and one more reason is that you've downloaded them from the PC VR page so you can't get PC VR mods on Nomad you have to download them from the Nomad page and if you're using PC VR you have to download them from the PC VR page